So I've just received uh, my brand new Flame Boss 400 controller out of the box. I have plugged it up to power supply. I've downloaded my uh, Flame Boss app to my, to my device and I'm now ready to add my controller. As you can see, I already have a couple controllers on my, on my app, but we want to add this one in particular. So what you'll do is hit controllers, add controller, and from the menu, you'll receive uh, a few different options. We have the 400 model, so I'm going to choose the 400 model. We want to set up our Wi-Fi, which will actually give us a connection we need directly to our controller and the access point mode. As you can see, the uh, controller is now has a slow blinking um, process going on, so we're going to hit next. And then without closing out our app, we're going to head over to the Wi-Fi settings. You want to press and hold the Wi-Fi button and it'll give you the Wi-Fi settings uh, menu option. We want to choose our device. You want to make sure that you wait for that message to clear out. And then also make sure that the, uh, the connection is no longer uh, trying to rejoin. All right, so now we're good to go. We're going to toggle back over to our Flame Boss app. And we are now connected directly to our app. Now we're going to hit next and we're going to now um, set up our Wi-Fi to our uh, controller. Now it does take a little bit of extra time um, for it to actually show up, but once it does, you will also get confirmation on your controller where your light goes from a fast blinking to a steady light. And there we are, we are now connected. We're going to hit OK. And now at the top, you can now see added controllers and the controller name. You can at that time rename it. Or just have a great cook.